Hello and welcome to Farming Simulator 2017 Mod Showcase with me, Kevin Sawyer. Hope you guys and girls are all well and enjoying your day, whatever you're up to. Right, I've got yet another little place ball, like I mentioned to you in the uh, last Mod Showcase. Um, I've got quite a few placeables for this um, modder. Uh, it's the, this is uh, the Dairy Argos. Um, well, Agros, um, so I should say. Um, and it's a placeable, so it's a placeable item. And this is version one of this mod. Um, and it's made by the modder of the name of the snake. Um, and again, like I said, I've been doing a at least one of quite a few of his mods now and this is another one of his mods anyway um once you, of course all the links will be in description down below for you guys and girls to have a look at and to have a go on for yourself but i'm going to show you how you use this um so what it is once you've downloaded it installed it you'll find it it's two part of mod again you'll find the first part of it here in placeables so to buy it costs 80,000 and it's 10 whatever currency you're working in per day in maintenance again like I say in all of his mods it makes sure it's on a nice flat bit of land and um, because you can see it glitches quite easily it does spin all the good stuff you can spin it around if you need to but just make sure it's on a nice flat bit of land Anyway, um, this is how it is once you first put it down, all empty, ready to go. Um, as you can see, it's got quite a lot of detail here. You've got like a nice little like pickup truck to sit here. It's dirty old pickup truck sitting over here. Um, over here is the info point. So if I bring up the dial-up box, walk over to it, it tells you what you need or what it produces. Um, resources you need is box milk. Um, empty cartons as well, empty pallets as well. Um, you're going to need all of those. And uh, with this one, it's quite um, good because it's got several points. You got it's got cheese comes out here, yogurt, butter comes out of here on the back, and also around the front here as well, cheese, yogurt, and butter right so you've got two options here you can either use the pallets from the sawmill which you did um, but you don't necessarily have to use these now because um, now he's brought something else in but if you bring these over to here you see they disappear just like that and it appears onto the pallet but in this mod um, he also gives you a point where you can purchase them as a pallet they're not the cheapest way of doing it admittedly um, but if you don't want to go about all the faffing around with the um, sawmill um, you can just buy the pallet straight from here so you're gonna need it all comes as part of them I don't know if it's just because I've got another mod which I'm going to be showcasing as well that this has appeared but you buy you can buy them from store so you can buy the empty pallets and these the boxes to sell so it costs a thousand pounds for each one um, to buy and they appear at your store point um, for your information once these also work with the previous mod which I did which was the uh, was the Jordan fabric I don't know if it will work with any of these other mods give it a try um, I suspect they will because um, if it's taken that script and then it's got to be based off of that script for the rest of them but anyway I digress so once you've bought them you bought the boxes and then you'll need to go and get them from your store um, I've just bought these from the store as well just to test to see if these work I suspect they do so if we walk over to this point Zoink disappears yep just as suspected so you can buy them now, you don't have to faff around with the whole sawmill. Um, so if you've got this mod as well as the other mods are done, you give it a try and see what happens. But here's the empty boxes you need to buy. I suspect at some point he's going to make a facility to make empty boxes, I suspect. 
Um, but don't quote me on that. I'm not reading his mind. I've just got a hunch. But you walk up. Once you the empty cardboard box is up there, again, you'll see them disappear. I doubt they're going to work with the other mods that I've got installed with the empty cardboard boxes again because there's probably different scripts. So it's probably better to work with these. Even though it says box, it doesn't say cardboard box, so I suspect it's probably not going to take the script. Again, just walk it over and zoink. Good to go. Right, so that's a couple of components in. What else are you going to need? You're going to need milk. Yes, that's what you're going to need. Good old humble milk, which if you've got the stop sell milk mod and the, set, and the trigger, milk triggers on your map, or the placeable versions on your map, then you can just go and get it from your um, cows. But you drive the milk up to this point where it's got unload, and then press R, and you can see it starts tipping it in. shut it off while it's pouring out um, and then it once it's full it should start going but I'm gonna leave it just ticking over so we walk over to this point we should just confirm it's going in so there we go you can see that milk is going in probably gonna take quite a fair amount of milk to fill this thing up I suspect yeah, it's only at 22%. But now it should have enough in it to uh, start producing the stuff that you need. So let's just start fast forwarding time. And it, you hear it click into action. Um, right, so here looks like cheese. Again, it's just building it up. And then that's yogurt. And then that's the butter. And again, you're going to have the same thing around the other side. Don't see any animation. Oh, there is smoke coming out of the stack. But what I'll do is I'll pause it here um, and wait until it's finished because it's going to look like it's going to take a while for it to finish. So um, I'll see you in a minute. Okay guys, welcome back to the uh, mod showcase. Um, what's been a blink of an eye to you has been an overnight stay for me. Um, quite literally it's taken like 24 hours to get this thing to fill up. Um, so I'd say this is probably one of those slow burner mods, not instant gratification. But let's see how much these things are worth. Right, so let's start off with this. Let's grab one of these, again super strength for bathed. And uh, let's go and dump it over by the point, the sales point. Again, if you haven't got the current version of this, or the newest version, it might be good to get the latest version as I throw it on the ground. So that gives you just over near enough seven grand for that cheese see how much the I guess in the modder has put in sort of like price fluctuations in this as well and um, so it probably goes up and down in price and you probably get price demands on this as well drop this down Yeah, eight and a half grand for that. And how much for the butter? Let's just drop that down. Oh, 
I like the boxes. The detail of boxes is quite nice. Let's quickly go back over to the other side. I won't sell them. I'll, I'll um, just leave it at that. But um, let's have a quick look at them. So that's what your cheese looks like. If I put the light on, just uh, make it easy, guys. For just this cheese, you can see those little cheese wheels in there. Pretty cool. Stacks up really slow. Takes forever. Um, again, that's the uh, that is yogurt. Don't know what flavoured yogurt that is, but it's yogurt. Um, <laughs> then there's the butter for you as well. Um, but I hope you guys and girls enjoyed the mod showcase. Um, again, the links for this will be in the description down below, so you can download and have a go of it. Um, if you did enjoy this, um, again, please feel free to like. Um, if you didn't enjoy this for any reason, again, please feel free to dislike, but leave a comment in the description, or well, leave a comment down below to why you didn't like this, so then at least then I can try to improve in the future. And if you know anyone else that may also enjoy this mod showcase or may find it useful, Again, guys and girls, please feel free to share. It helps me out a lot, and I don't mind you sharing. And if you're new to my channel and want to see future mod showcases, or anything else I'm working on, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so then you're notified as soon as I've uploaded something. I'll see you in the next one. TTFN.